Me, I don't know about you. Me, I cannot stay with one woman. No. Today, I will taste the dick icon. Next tomorrow, a goosey. Then the next day, a funk. And then enjoy a comment in the morning. Hey, wait for me, wait for me, wait for me, wait for me. Wait for me. Don't leave me. We have seen you now. Liquor of plate. First of all, I hope you know that that thing you are doing is affecting your risk of certain diseases. Eh, doctor, wear condom. Yes, I agree. Condom can protect you against some STDs, but it will not protect you against all. For example, herpes. The second one is HPV. Number three, Mpox. Number four, syphilis. Yes, because those particular ones are spread by skin-to-skin -skin contact. But you see that human papilloma virus, HPV. That one is the devil that made this specialty. Because there are over a hundred types. There's high-risk one, there's low-risk one. The high-risk one are the ones that respond responsible for cervical cancer. The low risk can cause what? I see that what? Once it starts like this, it starts to grow. Except, you know, you catch it on time. And even when you catch it on time, sometimes it can be very difficult to eradicate. You will treat night, you will show up next tomorrow. You will treat again, you will show up again. So if I were you, I would not treat my private organ like ATM and POS anywhere you see a fanya. You have absolutely no right at all to call your reproductive organ a private part again. It now belongs to the government. Is either you practice abstinence or you stick to one sexual partner. And yes, eh, I trust my sexual partner. My dear, trust is end. Every year at least, you know, every periodic period, both of you can go and go for STD screening. He brings his test, you, you bring your test, and then both of you will compare and compare.